I come from a family where nobody was allowed to be who they wanted to be. My family immigrated from parts of Belarus and Moldova to America somewhere in the mid-90s. Being of Jewish heritage, they were often discriminated against in their own countries. Jews were not allowed to work in certain areas and were restricted to working in poorly paid jobs such as being a clerk at a bank and manual labor. My mother described to me how she was often bullied and sneered at just because she was Jewish. Most, if not all of my family, were eventually forcefully relocated. My great-great-grandfather was sent to a labor camp in Siberia where he was later murdered by Stalin's regime. Instead of becoming a lawyer, my great-grandfather was thrown into a concentration camp in Germany. Instead of becoming a translator, my mother was forced to leave her home country and move to America at the age of 18. Those who survived and relocated to America came with a measly $25 in their pockets and the clothes they wore on their backs. Moving to America became a hidden blessing for my family. Even though they were poor and barely knew English, my family was finally able to become who they wanted to be. My mother became a pharmacist, my grandpa became an engineer, and my dad became a software developer. Even my great-grandfather, who survived the concentration camps, became a teacher in New York. Knowing my family's history has been absolutely crucial for me to figure out my own identity. My family's persistence through hard times has given me the courage to take on the almost insurmountable task of becoming a physician. I owe it to my family to be who I really want to be and not to hide and be ashamed of my identity. Every time I have wanted to quit my journey, my family has been there to remind me that if my family could conquer their hard times, so could I. I feel extremely lucky that I have never experienced persecution for who I am. I have no fear in expressing myself and I know that nobody can stop my dreams. In America, the only thing required to be successful is to work hard. My mother's story inspires me the most. I still don't fully understand how she was able to come to this country at 18 with only $25 in her pocket and become as successful as she has. Due to the freedom that America offered her, she realized that she was capable of doing more than being a translator and went on to a professional school to earn her PharmD. My parents always encouraged me to explore my identity and to figure out what I wanted to do in my life. I was the first one to be born in America and my parents could have easily coddled me and made my life easy. I'm thankful they did not do that. They opted to make me work for everything I wanted. As a result of that, I have gained the confidence necessary to want to pursue becoming a physician. In addition, my family always reminded me of my family's history in order to keep me in check. Whenever I felt like giving up and complaining, I remembered what my family sacrificed for me to be able to live a fruitful life here.